You have to fight because you can't count on anyone else fighting for you, and you have to fight for people who can't fight for themselves. The knowledge that everything good can be taken away at any second is what makes me work so hard. Life is a fight from the minute you take your first breath to the moment you exhale your last. Everyone wants to win. But to truly succeed, whether it is at a sport or at your job or in life, you have to be willing to do the hard work, overcome the challenges, and make the sacrifices it takes to be the best at what you do. To be the best, you have to constantly be challenging yourself, raising the bar, pushing the limits of what you can do. Don't stand still, leap forward. Success is the result of hard work, busting your ass every day for years on end without cutting corners or taking shortcuts. No one is ever going to give you anything of value. You have to work for it, sweat for it, fight for it. But there is far greater value in accomplishments you earn than in accolades that are merely given to you. When you earn something, you never have to worry about justifying that you truly deserve it. You make the sacrifices anyway. You learn to enjoy them, or at least embrace them. In the end, it is the sacrifices that must fulfill you. It is not about just winning the round. It is not just about winning the fight. It is about winning every single second of your life. I want to be a perfect fighter, and that's one of those unattainable goals because you will never be perfect but I can always be closer to perfect. She taught me that it is not enough to just be better than everyone else. You have to be so much better that no one can deny your superiority. You have to win so clearly that they have no choice but to declare you the winner. You have to be able to win every match twice on your worst day. I might not have had the tools at my disposal that my opponents had, but I created advantages of my own. To be a fighter, you have to be passionate. I have so much passion, it's hard to hold it all in. That passion escapes as tears from my eyes, sweat from my pores, blood from my veins. I like to be part of the change I want to see in the world. Not being afraid of criticism is actually a big advantage. I feel like I tried to be agreeable and failed, it failed me. And so I just did not give a shit and ended up succeeding a lot more because of it. There is nothing in my life that I would go back and change, even the darkest moments. All the successes and greatest joys in my life are a result of the absolute worst things. Every missed opportunity is a blessing in disguise. Once you've conquered the worst things that could happen, there is no need to fear the unknown. You are fearless. The kind of hope I'm talking about is the belief that something good will come. That everything you're going through and everything you've gone through will be worth the struggles and frustrations. The kind of hope I'm talking about is a deep belief that the world can be changed, that the impossible is possible. Everything in the world is information. The information you choose to acknowledge and the information you choose to ignore is up to you. You can let outside factors beyond your control throw off your focus. You can let aching muscles hold you back. You can let silence make you feel uncomfortable. By choosing to focus only on the information that is necessary, you can tune out every distraction and achieve far more. I am not looking to escape the pressure. I am embracing it. 
pressure is what builds up in the chamber behind a bullet before it explodes out of the gun. Once you give them the power to tell you you're great, you've also given them the power to tell you you're unworthy. No matter how much you try or what you say, people aren't going to fully understand you or where you're coming from. You just have to get used to being misunderstood. Rhonda Jean Rousey was born in Riverside, California on February 1, 1987, the youngest of three daughters of Anne Maria de Mars, Waddell, and Ronald John Rousey, after whom she was named. Her mother, a decorated judoka, was the first American to win a World Judo Championship, in 1984, as Anne Maria Burns, Rousey is of English, Polish, and, through her maternal grandfather, Trinidadian, Venezuelan and Canadian ancestry. One of her maternal great-grandfathers, Alfred E. Waddell, was a Trinidadian doctor who emigrated to Canada and became one of the first black physicians in North America while a maternal great-grandmother was born in Caracas, Venezuela. Her stepfather is an aerospace engineer. Rhonda Rousey is an American professional wrestler, actress, former judoka, and mixed martial artist. She is currently signed to WWE, where she performs on the Raw brand. Prior to joining WWE, she was known for her time in the Ultimate Fighting Championship UFC. She received permission from professional wrestler Roddy Piper to use his Rowdy nickname. She was the first American woman to win an Olympic medal in judo by winning bronze at the 2008 Summer Olympics. Rousey began her mixed martial arts MMA career with King of the Cage in 2011. She soon joined Strike Force, becoming their last women's bantamweight champion until its acquisition by UFC. Rousey was part of the company's first ever female fight at UFC 157. Was their inaugural women's bantamweight champion and held the record for most UFC title defenses, six, by a female, until being surpassed by Valentina Shevchenko in 2022. Rousey retired from MMA in 2016 and was the first female fighter inducted into the UFC Hall of Fame in 2018. Rousey began a career in professional wrestling in 2018, signing with WWE, and debuted at WrestleMania 34. She won the Raw Women's Championship at that year's SummerSlam, and headlined WWE's only all-women's pay-per-view evolution, in which she defended the title. Rousey lost the title in the first ever women's WrestleMania main event at WrestleMania 35. Rousey returned at the 2022 Royal Rumble, winning the women's Royal Rumble match. That year, she would win the SmackDown Women's Championship twice, making her an overall three-time women's world champion in WWE. She became the eight women's triple crown champion when she won the WWE Women's Tag Team Championship with Shayna Baszler. Rousey and Baszler also unified the WWE and NXT Women's Tag Team Championships. Rousey is the only woman to be the champion in both the UFC and WWE as well as the only woman to headline a pay-per-view event in both companies. She was voted the best female athlete of all time in a 2015 ESPN fan poll, 
and Fox Sports described her as one of the defining athletes of the 21st century. Rousey has also appeared in films, including The Expendables 3, 2014, Furious 7, 2015, and Mile 22, 2018, and Relagraphy My Fight, Your Fight in 2015.